All right, so we're going to balance a tire. Uh, there's two ways to mount a tire on the balance machine. Um, I'll show you both of them. First of all, for either method, you need a cone that fits in the center hole of the tire. So method number one, you put the cone on first, put the wheel over the cone. Notice I got the outside of the wheel facing the outside of the machine. If you put it on the other way, it won't work good. And then you put this plastic cap over where the lug nuts go. Then you screw this um, nut on. Now it has a quick release, so you don't have to screw it on all the way. You just push the trigger, and slide it up as far as you can, let go of the trigger, and then you can crank it on. While you're cranking it, you want to step on this foot brake here and hold the shaft from turning with your other hand. And you want to get it pretty much as tight as you can, okay? That's method number one. Method number two, You, you take the tire, the wheel, put it on first, and then you put that same cone, the one that fits right in the middle, and you got to get it so it fits in that hole, and then put, just put the nut on top of the cone. Either way works, depending on what type of wheels you got, one way might work out better for you than the other way. The next thing you have to do is measure the wheel. We're going to actually measure the width of the wheel and the diameter of the wheel. We're going to do that with this arm. So take this arm out and touch the rim, not the tire, but the rim. You heard it beep, okay? Then we're going to take this arm and touch it to this side of the wheel. And you hear the beep. When you're done with that, you just close the lid. So it's spinning the tire, trying to measure where it needs to have weight added. And on the screen it tells us uh, that we need a half an ounce, 0.5 of an ounce on this side, and one ounce on this side. Now to find out exactly where we put that half an ounce, we're going to spin this tire until we get a green light right here. Right there. And then we're going to find a half an ounce weight. Now be careful when you're selecting your weights. There's two size weights here, uh, depending if you have a steel wear, wheel or an aluminum wheel. The one with the small gap right here is for a steel, and the big gap is aluminum. This is a steel wheel, so I've got a half an ounce weight. I rotate the tire until the green light lights up, and then there's an arrow right here. That means I'm going to put that weight right here at 12 o'clock. Okay, now I need to rotate it until the green light lights up on this side. And then I need to find a one ounce weight, which is going to be right here. I need to make sure it's for a steel wheel. And I'm going to put it at exactly 12 o'clock on this side. Once you've done that, you close the lid again. And if you did it right, this will come up all zeros. So apparently, I know what I'm doing. That's odd. All right, have fun mounting tires. <laughs>